want to eat me up. Hell no, I don't. Ah, good day everyone and welcome to today's video where I am very excited because I have my waffle maker here again and we're gonna get to destroying some more foods. We did this before and it turns out you can waffle a lot of foods and make them delicious. So today we're gonna be doing more of those. Without further ado, let's get on with the video. Okay, so first thing into the waffle maker is some vegan chicken nuggets and french fries from McDonald's. Now, I haven't had a french fry from McDonald's in a long time. They're actually kind of cold now, which I don't want cold fries. So we're gonna heat them up by putting them in here. Um, let's put some chicken nuggets in here first, and then we'll add the french fries in. So it'll be like a whole McDonald's smorgasbord. Smorgasbord, I don't know. We'll see if this could turn into a waffle. Here, let's just go like this. There we go. That looks delicious, delectable. Oh my god, my mouth is water. Slurp it up. Oh gosh, I feel like this could be a really yummy waffle. Okay, let's close this bad boy. And let's get to waffling. Yippee! Okay, so it's been a couple minutes. Let's check in this waffle maker and see the beauty that could be. Come on, be a gorgeous french fry, chicken nugget, waffle. This is, t oh, okay. Well, <laughs> not, not that pretty. Oh, goodness. It's just like a, a heap of french fries just smushed together. Although the chicken nugget made the, the imprint. There we go, a french fry waffle. Mmm. <laughs> this actually does look really good. All right, let's get it all over. Okay, kind of crumbled apart. Let's have a little taste test. Hot, hot, hot. Ooh, hot as The tease, your tease, how dare you tease me? They're soggy. You know, you can never reheat McDonald's french fries. Once they're hot and they go cold, there's no going back. All right, this was a fail. This was a failed freaking waffle. Let's move on. In case you're wondering how much oil is in your french fries, here's just a little, a little look. Ugh, that's, that's gross. Okay, so up next is some mac and cheese. So I'm going to try and do this one a little bit better. I think because I put the french fries all in, like on top of each other, it wasn't able to waffleize. so, I'm gonna be a little more cleaner with the mac and cheese. Oh, she's a sizzler, sister. Come on, be all right, I gotta just do this quick. Okay, that looks good, looks solid. Let's crush it and let's make it into a waffle. Ooh, sizzlanya. Oh, I can already tell this is gonna do well. She's gonna waffle eyes real good like. Oh my gosh, the cheesy scent! Wow! Oh, I wonder if it's gonna make like a crispy coat at the top. Okay, so it's been in here for a couple minutes. Let's open it up and see what she looks like. Oh, wow! Okay, this one waffle eyes way more than the freaking french fries. Come on! Grilled cheese waffle, not grilled cheese, mac and cheese. Okay, so it kind of stuck together, um, but not really. But let's try a little piece. Ooh, a piece of mac and cheese waffle. Oh, this is real hot. Bon appetit. Oh, hot, ooh, mmm. Okay, yep. I like the crunch that it gives. It's good. <laughs> Okay, that's yummy, holy crap. It adds a little bit of crispiness to your mac and cheese. You gotta try this, guys. It's good. <sighs> okay, so the next one is gonna be real freaking yummy because I am to, oh, sprinkly cupcakes. I feel like these are gonna be really freaking good because they're already good on their own. So I don't know if they're gonna waffleize. I guess we'll find out. 
But I have four of them. Oh my god, they look so freaking juicy. Oh, wow. Oh. Okay, we'll just put this right there. This is very thick. Okay, so all four of them are in here, but it looks like it's really big, so I might cut the bottoms off of them. I don't know yet. I'm just going to try and close them in. But say goodbye to the pretty frosting, because it's going away. Wow, that looks so freaking yummy! Give this video a thumbs up if your mouth has already started watering from anything you saw in this video and you feel a little hungry now. I mean, maybe that kind of looks like poop. So maybe your mouth isn't watering and maybe you're like, ooh. Okay, so it's been in here for a couple of minutes and it smells real freaking delicious. So I think we need to have the big wig reveal happen in three, two, one. <gasps> It looks like an actual waffle. This has been by far the best waffle we have had. <gasps> Here, let's pour some sprinkles on there. Oh, she's bubbling boobly in there. Look at that bubbling boobly goobly. Wow, this is the most magical waffle I've ever seen. Okay, let's have a little taste. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Oh my God, oh my goodness. Mm. Oh wow, that's, that's some good, that's some good eating, that is good. <laughs> Do I got something in my tooth? Oh, sorry. Guys, I think this is my actual, <laughs> I feel like, I need to take this out of my tooth. This is so freaking good. I don't know if it's just because the cupcake was good or because it's like a super hot cupcake that's a little melted. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. This is up there with the damn Cinnabon, if not better. Wow, it did, it waffled. That's amazing. You guys have to try freaking waffled cupcakes. Oh, it's just so damn good. I could just sit here for the rest of the video and just eat this and I'd be happy. But I'm not going to because we are going to move on to our final waffle mission and that is we're gonna waffle pizza. Let's do it. Alrighty, so here we go. I cut this little pizza crust from a giant one, and I'm gonna place that on in here, and then I'm gonna take some tomato sauce, and we're making our own little pizza. Okay, that's, that's a lot. Let's just spread that around. Mm, oh, this is definitely gonna come straight off the sides. I think I added a little bit too much. And then we're gonna finish with some cheese and all, okay? The cheese will actually hold it in place. I don't know. This, this could be a really cool way to make pizza. Okay, I'm excited. I don't know what's gonna happen. Let's do this! Will it waffle? I don't know! She's screaming until it. Get in there, miss. Why is it making those noises? Ew! Just having a rough day. It's, it's been one of those days. Okay, it's starting to stink a little. Girl, you've been farting up a storm. Now let's see what you've been cooking inside. Ugh! That is the ugliest pizza I've ever seen in my life. That looks terrifying. Ugh! That's scary. I don't like that at all. Here I am, I'm a waffle pizza. Don't you just wanna eat me up? Hell no I don't. After you just farting all that cheese out and now you look like this, I think I'll pass, but I am really curious. <gasps> okay, this has been definitely the easiest waffle to get off of the waffle maker. Okay, there we go. It's a slice of ugly pizza. Honestly, this is actually a really cool way to make pizza. I just wish it didn't have to look like this. Okay, so I don't have a fork to eat this with, so I'm just gonna take this nap. <laughs> this is my new fork. Don't follow my lead, children. Okay. Oh! Mmm! Crunchy bottom. Oh, the cheese is sticking to the roof of my mouth. Um. Yeah, that cheese is real sticky. 
aside from the cheese, it's pretty good. I feel like this is good if you're not allowed to use the stove, but you can use a waffle maker and you want pizza real bad, do this or just order it, honestly. Probably save you time and energy. But anyways, that's it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like and let me know if you want to see more of these types of videos. There's a lot more things I can waffle. So leave me some suggestions down below. And that's it for today. I love you. I will see you all tomorrow. Good damn. Bye.